my love so we are hopping right into this video of course you want to start with your hair braided straight to the back and I'm just going in with some got to be gel to pretty much lay her edges down so once I go to put the wig on none of her edges get caught you know what I'm saying now I'm just going to take my blow dryer and blow dry that until it's dry once I finish with the got to be I'm going to then start putting on the wig cap now, if you guys are wondering, why is it so light? Why is it so light? So, so you'll see in a second, okay? You want to use this nude colored cap. Or maybe you can use whatever cap you prefer. This is my preference. But I'm going to go in with some powder that matches her skin tone and apply that directly on the cap. Also, you guys, I prefer to do this before applying my adhesive on top because it just lays better, okay? So now I'm going back in with the got to be gel and this is going to make sure that the wig cap is secure and doesn't move underneath the wig okay now if you're throwing a wig on and then you're taking it off that same day sis you don't have to do this step you can just throw your wig cap on and keep it pushing all right but i'm going in with the gel and then i'm going to also blow dry this until she is all dry okay get it real dry now i'm also going to go back in with some free spray this has also got to be same company, same brand, y'all. It's really cold. So you can see why Jada is making that face. <laughs> so go back in with the freeze spray and make sure that we blow dry this. So get it really dry. Now, if you guys are wondering who is this beautiful lady on my channel, this is Miss Jada. She is the founder and owner of Waxpert Lofts. She also has a YouTube channel, you guys. I will put the handle on the screen. So make sure you go check her out if you guys like pimple popping videos and you know extractions and waxes and all that gruesome stuff y'all <laughs> if that's your cup of tea go check her out y'all she is the bomb diggity okay she is located in st louis missouri now what i'm doing now is cutting off this excess cap after everything has been dried you guys if you were watching closely i already did the sides of the ear tabs to make sure that the cap didn't lift too much before i went to cut off the fronts okay Okay, now if you need to go rewind and rewatch, you do that sis, but this is really easy step. Make sure you're getting as close as possible to where you applied that gel. Now I'm going to go in with some powder contour and apply that directly on the back lace of the wig. I apologize y'all because I didn't realize how out of frame I was. Jesus Louise. But yes, I'm just applying this to make sure this blends seamlessly into her skin. Now I'm just going to line this wig up where it needs to be. Now I did not pluck this wig a lot. We were going for a more fuller hairline. But y'all just wait to the end because it turned out so freaking cute. But I'm just going in and cutting off this lace from the hairline. And a lot of people always ask, how do you cut the lace? So it's just follow the natural hairline. Whatever hairline you created after you plucked it and bleached it and all that good stuff, just follow it. Make sure it lines up with her natural hairline though now. If you have a client or if you personally have like a widow's peak, it can get a little tricky, but it's doable. Anything is possible in this life, okay? So that's what I'm doing. I'm just cutting off the lace, taking my sweet time. I like to start in the middle middle and then work my way on each side okay now I'm going in with my freeze spray I'm going to apply this in the middle first blow dry it and then apply a second layer now let me tell y'all because this is a wig we were doing a very temporary hold freeze spray will not last you forever sis okay <clears throat> all right it's gonna last you about two days three days max before you need to reinstall now the reason we did this was because again it's a wig not a sew-in okay so now I'm just going down and securing the fronts of this unit going back in with the blow dryer to get that secure 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 the back secure the wig okay and then just using my comb to press that into her skin now going back in with the free spray y'all you see that face she was making <laughs> blow drying it and then going in again with the second layer now i do apologize in advance because my arm was all in the way y'all when i went to the, um secure this side of the wig my bad y'all my bad i did better on the other side you know what i'm saying but i pretty much just did the exact same thing that i did in the middle 
secure it down you know press it into the skin with my comb and you guys are also going to see some pieces of lace not laid down but I'm gonna show you a little later how to fix that okay because again this is a very temporary hold so you don't have to be a perfectionist it'll be all right okay 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 it's gonna be all right so now we're working on the right side free spray dry free spray dry secure the wig oh that could be a song or something somebody need to remix that so yeah, this is super easy, y'all. Ain't rocket science. The more you do it, the better you'll get. Okay. Also, make sure you are pulling it, but not too, too not too much. Just pulling it, little tension, just to make sure the wig is super, super flat. You know, no humps, no lumps, no bumps. So we don't want none of that. Okay. Press it into the skin. Go in with the blow dryer. Did I do that? I should have. Maybe I didn't. I don't know. But y'all see that little flap? We're going to take care of that a little later. Okay, so front tools nine times out of ten are going to be a little too big for your head. So we are now cutting off the access that goes over her ear, y'all. After we're done with all of that, it is time to style her. Get it together. Get it together. This color looks so good on Jayla's skin. If you guys agree, go ahead and give this video a thumbs up for your girl. Now, y'all know I'm using my two favorite products of all time. I use this in every styling video. Everything that I'm using will be in the description box down below. All right. Now, this flat urn is a baby bliss flat urn. And all I'm doing is I'm going to do every layer different if that makes sense so first layer I'm going to be curling over second layer I'm going to be curling under and repeat and repeat this is really a watch and learn thing you guys that's why I did not fast forward this part also you want to do this to avoid your curls rolling into each other nothing irritates me more than when my hair does that y'all feel me do you feel me if you feel me give this video a thumbs up and go ahead and hit that subscribe button sis all right so again curling under as you guys can see the previous layer that I just did I curled over but this one I'm curling under this is going to make your curls really voluptuous you know real body yaddy yaddy and not roll together okay we don't want that we don't want no rolls okay we want our hair to be flowing volume body and lasting all day do you feel me can I get a hallelujah can I get an amen okay so again y'all this is really self-explanatory I like to curl the hair twice while it's in the flat iron look at that look at that oh beautiful so yeah y'all it's real cute oh she's gonna be so cute y'all oh she ain't even know let me tell y'all a secret so i colored this hair for her and i didn't tell her what color we was doing <laughs> i just surprised her but it turned out so bomb up against her skin tone if y'all agree go ahead head to her channel and hit that subscribe button on hers as well don't forget me either okay show the love share the love so once we get done curling look at her feeling herself now I'm going to go ahead and take care of those pieces that did not get laid down with my freeze spray. And I'm just applying some got to be and then just, you know, do a little swoop, 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 -de -de swoop you know, a little swoop, swoop. And just combing it right back into the hair, y'all. <clears throat> oh, I'm getting a little summer cold. It's so irritating. Hate it. Hate it. Hate it. <sighs> just don't want me to be great. They don't want me to be editing these videos for y'all. But I got you. I'm coming through regardless, okay? So I'm just going ahead with my wide tooth comb and combing these curls out. And then I'm going to go in with my little razor comb and just give her some slight layers for those, uh, not a bang, but just the front of her hair so it can flow real nice into the rest of her hair. And, you know, give it a little volume in the front. So I didn't do much. I didn't want to cut it too much because if she wants to flatter her hair, I don't want it to look real choppy and you know what I'm saying? I had to give my girl some options, okay? So look at how cute she look, y'all. Now I'm just going in with my curling iron to flatten out the top of this wig because as I always say, just because it's a wig don't mean everybody needs to know, okay? So again, just going back in with that wide tooth comb. I got this comb from Sally's, y'all. It is, I love it. I love it. I don't know what they put in this comb. I don't know how they made it. I don't know how far apart these um, combs are from each other, but it's heaven sent. Okay, so now I'm going in with my Care Care wax stick to get them flyaways away. <laughs> okay, and combing it through, y'all. And that's pretty much it. Thanks for kicking it with us. Thanks for hanging out. Thanks for making it to the end of this video. If you have not liked and hit that subscribe button, what are you doing, sis? What are you doing? Come on, join the family. 
head to Jada's channel go check her out if you are into that gruesome stuff and we're also having a video coming soon so make sure y'all check that out too because it's gonna be funny as hell but thanks for kicking it with us y'all I hope y'all enjoyed this video and I will see you in my next one y'all know I love y'all and appreciate every single one of you look at Jada she's so cute feeling herself want a new dude that want a new wow want a new dude do that y'all know what I meant to say I'll catch y'all a little later. God bless.